all right so good day everybody i think uh, this topic we have now is is very interesting so and it's going to change some lives you understand so it's going to change those who really wants to change you understand now and i title it the past yes the past i know some of you will be wondering what is the past and all that don't worry calm down slow down i'm going to throw more light on it so that you understand what i'm talking about you understand so you know some of you girls are living a life that you know especially when you are privileged to live the the kind of life that you wish you understand not thinking of the future are you get what i'm saying so there's a kind of past you have and it's going to affect your future forever you understand i've witnessed so many people that are living and they are regretting their lives today because of the kind of life they have lived in the past you understand and it's affecting them even in their marriage you understand so i keep telling people that you know mind the kind of life you live you have to be very conscious of your life the kind of people you mingle yourself with the kind of lifestyle you are living so that it won't affect your future you understand so you know i'm also using the bell again and shares to give you an example you understand so you know i know that sometimes you people think that love supersedes all that if you love this person that uh, uh his or her past doesn't matter i'm not only talking about women i'm talking about men also you understand but you know let's just begin to change this mentality that uh, love you know that uh, with love love conquers all no it is a lie let me tell you there are kind of past you have as a woman and if me if your let me just say if your fiance should find out trust me he's going to dump you i know some of you are saying that if the person really love you and they, no sometimes love cannot save you yes love is not enough to save some certain situation i keep telling you this you understand i keep telling you this there are some kind of situation that you find yourself and love cannot save no matter how your husband loves you no matter how your wife loves you trust me if the person gets to find out the person is going to dump you forever you understand so that's why some things are meant to keep secret forever <laughs> i know some of you will be wondering you know uh, this is because uh, this topic is going to shake the table yes some secrets some past are meant to be to be kept secret forever there are kind of past you reveal to somebody and it's going to affect you it's going to scatter your marriage it's going to affect you forever so some past need to keep secret you understand so you are a girl and you have dated about 20 something guys within a couple of one year I have, you have lived a life that that you are not you are not even proud of yourself forgetting that tomorrow you get married forgetting that that past life you have lived is going to affect you in your future you understand so as a young girl as you are growing up you have to be you have to live a responsible life a life that you know even your even your husband will be proud of it because some of you you are not proud of your past you know i've seen a lot of posts on social media and imagine a young girl who have not yet married who post her body and her stance you know forgetting that something that you post on it, social media will be there forever you understand somebody might watch it and save it another person might watch and save it on his or her phone it's going to be there forever you know what were you thinking when you post your open body picture and you think tomorrow is not going to affect you you know i keep commenting on any video that i saw in this section i keep advising them that you know when you i keep asking them this question will you be proud of this video or this picture 
in front of your children or in front of your born children. Yes, anything that you can, you are not proud of, you are not supposed to be doing it. You understand? So imagine somebody would just bath and open her body, take a picture and post it on social media. You think tomorrow is not going to affect you? What if your husband should come across it? What if tomorrow, yes, you get married and maybe your husband is pressing his phone and he, he come across your naked picture on social media? Do you think he's not capable of breaking that marriage or that relationship? No. You know, I'm asking you a question and you need to answer it on the comment section. Do you know why Bella is so much respected? It's because Bella doesn't have her ugly past. I don't really know her much, but the little I have known her, she doesn't have a past. In fact, she doesn't have a very ugly past. And that's why she has respect her so much. Yes, I know that she have posted some of her pictures on the social media, but you know she did it because of the brand. You know she she's she's working on, she's working with. You understand? So which I've already talked about it. Yes, that when you go to her Instagram, you see some kind of picture that is not good. But on the second thought, I, I you know I said okay, this is the brand that she's working with, an international brand. You understand so and uh, she did it because of the brand that is the kind of things they do you understand so i think that one should be different now even when the husband should see shares you understand that this is the kind of thing that he you know she's into just like an actress or an actor they said that kind of character you act people will know that this is a movie you understand you are just trying to interpret a character Yes, they are not trying to make it new real. Not that is the kind of life you live. You understand? So that one is understandable is aside now. You understand? So, but the one I'm talking about is a young girl. You are not doing anything. You just want to post. You just want to post to somebody. Maybe you are looking for money. You want somebody to watch the picture and say, okay, send your account number and all that. That is the one I'm totally against. So your past can affect your future. Your past can destroy your marriage. Your past can destroy good things that somebody wants to do with you. Your past can destroy your business partner. Your past can destroy so many things in your life. And you people are not thinking about it. You're only interested in uh, uh, life is free. You make use of it. Yes, that is the mentality you have grown up with. Life is free. Make use of the best opportunity you have and all that. Life is short. See, let me tell you. There are some certain things you are not supposed to post on social media. There are kind of things you post on social media and it will affect you for the rest of your life. Yes. Whatever I'm telling you today is out of experience. You understand? A lot of guests they are regretting their life, how they lived their past life. Their past is dealing with them, even as I'm talking to you. You understand? So you need to be very careful. You need to be extremely careful. Think about your children, your born children. They will grow up one day and they will have access to a smartphone. What if they should come across it? How will you explain it to them? How will you explain to them that, you know, your your picture is on over the social media your naked picture is on over the social media you understand means i is talking to you you know i'm always careful the kind of life that i need because my children they will grow up one day and they will have access to smartphone and they, they will start asking questions you understand they will start asking questions you know like daddy what is the meaning of this? Who is this? Why did you post this? So can you defend it? You understand? And some of you are not thinking about it. So a lot of people have lost it. A lot of people have lost everything. No good mentor. Nobody is there to advise them. Nobody is there to guide them. Nobody is there to, you know, to give them the, the good direction to take. Everybody is just living 
the way he or she wants and is dealing with them so sometimes i'll see a young girl that is living a a, a life that is not worthy of emotional and i'll be just shaking my hands and god why when this person will realize all this maybe it will become too late maybe that's when he, he, uh, she will get married and all this thing will, the reality will begin to showcase you understand your past can deal with your future if you are not careful your past can really deal with you. it can destroy so many things in your future you understand gone are days when they will tell you that even uh, if you should find out you, your your past doesn't matter no matter how uh, your past is a man who truly love you will stay it is a lie men their eyes are open now okay let me give you an example these days uh, if if a man wants to get married he will start digging he will start asking questions your family background they will even go to the extent of asking how your mother lived her life to know whether in your lineage if there is anybody that is fat if there is anybody that is stubborn if there is anybody that you know has one sickness or the other they will start digging you know asking so many questions to people around you your village people and all that so you see that you know if they should find something that is not encouraging trust me that marriage is going to crash so that's why you have to be very careful don't allow your past to deal with your future you understand live a life that you can explain you can be proud of you can be proud in front of your children in front of your born children in front of your parents some of you are living a life that you are not proud of something that you are not proud of why are you doing it why not drop it you understand as a man you are living you are drinking after drinking you you know you forgot yourself on the road and all that so and you know you think all this thing is not going to deal with your future see let me tell you it is high time you start thinking about your future it is high time you start thinking about what if tomorrow you know my 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 children will find out my upon children will find you know how are you going to explain to them you understand i have really talked about all this similar issue i've really made the several video about it you understand but this time i think i have to come openly because some of you have lost it some of you have you know you know i don't know i don't really understand the the generation we are into again because a lot of things are happening you understand imagine a young girl dating two boys a two to three boyfriends five boyfriends at the same time what are you thinking what are you thinking you think relationship is a is a poverty elevation center wherever you can you know i don't know how to put this but some of you think that relationship is a poverty elevation center where you can get money where you receive salary you think it's a relationship is about federal work where or state work where you receive monthly salary no work 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 it yourself you can get that money as long as you have your two hands your two legs you can get that money stop living a life that is not worthy of investing just because you are looking for money just because you are trying to earn a living no even those doesn't have it. let me tell you this i will i went to an number i saw a one man he doesn't have two legs uh you know when i i saw him i started asking questions what really happens to this man he told me that this man had an accident and uh, along the nine they cut off his two legs and the first wife that he married ran away so do you know that this man went and started learning mechanic before you know it he you know he became a guy of his own and he had so many workers working under him and the man is making it so if that man can have something doing if that man can say okay i don't want to do something that will affect my future let me go and look for something to do somebody that doesn't have two legs anytime you 
anytime you see him he's always on a wheelchair you know working on people's uh, machines you know so many things if that man can be that useful for himself what happens to you that's have your two legs your two hands work on your money stop living a life that it can affect your future so this thing is titled the past and i'm using bella and shares as an example you understand so there's a reason why you know she is still with bella because he has done his research he has asked questions and bella has a very bright past it's not only future that is bright if your past is not bright if your past wasn't bright rather trust me it will affect your future that is the end of this video please just think about it and if you have any question to ask drop it on a comment section and i'll be there to reply you all right thank you and god bless you please if you love what we're doing please i would like you to subscribe to this channel if you have not subscribed all right thank you and god bless everyone